Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you guys have not noticed, I created a new intro a few weeks ago. It's the same sound, just like a different look to everything. Also, thank you guys so much for 19,000 subscribers. That is crazy. If you have not already, go ahead and subscribe. I usually say this after, but I really did just want to say thank you guys for letting me do what I do. Try not to be too focused on numbers, but it is a good indication that you guys like my videos. So it's very sweet and I'm really thankful. So as you can tell from the title, I am headed to Jacksonville this weekend. It is Friday around 4 o'clock. Usually I would have left by now, but I just got the iPhone 13. I'm not using it right now, but I'm waiting on it to come and I can't leave until it comes. I'm excited to see what's different. I honestly don't even know what is different about this one. Hopefully the camera quality is better because that's what matters the most to me because if y'all don't know, I shoot most of my stuff on my iPhone. And actually, for Darian and I's four years, I got him a camera. And it also doubles as a vlog camera. So I might be using that for some of my stuff too. So we are just making upgrades all over the place around here. To be determined if it even comes before we leave. I'm riding with Olivia to Jacksonville, thank God. It's always so much more fun when we ride together. Darian actually gets to come on this trip as well, but he is flying in tomorrow. No, sorry, Sunday, because he has a game tomorrow. So he's flying in early Sunday and leaving early Monday to make it back to practice on Monday. So he does get to go to the game with us. We're going to the Jaguars game on Sunday afternoon. This is actually my first Jaguar home game and my first game that I get to go to with Darian. So that's really fun. All of us are going to be there. Monica, Dalton, Andrew, Olivia, obviously Marissa, Trevor. And then us, so I'm so excited to be with everybody. It's actually Andrew's birthday as well, so we are celebrating that. Andrew's also about to move to Jacksonville, which is crazy. So there's just a lot of things planned. As you can see, I'm not packed at all. All my Steve Madden stuff came in, and so it's just kind of sitting all over my room. So I still need to pack, and I'll be checking out the window to see if my package will come in time. Well guys, the iPhone never came. So hopefully my mom. Oh, I didn't realize. I know. Very sad. The first clip where I was talking in my bed was like four hours ago. And it never came throughout the whole day. But obviously I did finish packing. And Olivia picked me up. And we went to Starbucks. You already know I got the really gross. Yours is gross? Yeah. Mine was gross at first too. The only added. Starbucks that's really good is Clemson. Clemson Starbucks? hits every time. I don't think they've ever messed up my order. I got a grande pumpkin cream cold brew with only one pump of vanilla, but I did add vanilla on the side. Liv, what did you get? Iced vanilla coffee with almond milk, no classic. But what you wanted and they didn't have is... <laughs> Sounds very complicated, but it's a cinnamon almond milk cold brew with one pump of pumpkin. It's a discontinued drink, but if you ask them, they'll make it. It just sounds complicated. So we are 30 minutes away from Columbia and from Columbia to Jacksonville. It's like four hours. It's like four hours. That's not that bad. I also love driving. It clears my mind. Yeah, except for, I don't know how you have a clear mind when all we do is chatterbox in here. I like driving with my Nice to let me know. trips, I like having my friends with me. Do you guys have any questions? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> what should we talk about? Is there anything we should like update them on? I got a manager. I don't think I've told y'all that. I was gonna wait till like a Q&A to like spill that, but manager I don't think y'all care that much. Manager reveal. She's the best person ever. Like I truly could not think of a better person to work with. She is so involved, knows exactly what she's doing, knows so many brands, just is very like professional, but also like fun and just really cares. And I just love her. Shout out to you, Logan. But other than that, I really don't know. Oh, I dyed my hair darker. Update. But it's super greasy right now, so it's not as fun. I'm trying to I brainstorm. I really want to do a Q&A with you. Let's do it. But when? We'll keep you updated if we have anything to talk to you about, but otherwise, bye. Bye. We've arrived. Why is it so cold in this room? It's literally freezing. Everyone's asleep. Um, We made it safe. We'll see you tomorrow morning.
Hello guys, sorry to interrupt this little Jacksonville vlog, but I just got a new perfume from Dossier. If you guys do not know about Dossier, I have worked with them for probably like seven months. They're my favorite perfume brand ever. And what they do is they take expensive luxury scents and make inspired by perfumes for them. So basically they will take a $300 perfume and make it smell virtually the exact same for only $29. Every single perfume on their website is $29. So you always know what you're gonna get. I have personally tried probably like 20 different perfumes and there hasn't been any that I do not like. I tried a few that I've tried the original versions of and they smell pretty much exactly the same, which is crazy to me because you are saving so much money. All of their perfume boxes come with a little card that kind of explains everything about the perfume as well as a little sample bottle so that you can try it before you open the actual bottle of perfume. So if you don't like it, you can return it within 30 days and pick out another one. Their customer service is top tier. I have never had an issue with them. I just really love their brand and their company and I love how much money that I save in perfumes with them. So let's see what we're opening today. I have not smelled them. So so I'm very excited. Today we have Florental Almond. This is the little card that I was telling you guys about. It has the notes, which is almond, peach, orange blossom, etc. I already know that I'm gonna love this one. Inspired by the Carolina Herrera, good girl. Also, I just love their packaging. It says, Iconic sense, designer quality, no markups on the top. And I just love their little simple bottles. So let's give this a try. I already love it, but I'm gonna spray it. Oh, this one is really, really good. It's like a very sexy scent. I sprayed a little bit too much, um, but I've tried pretty much all of the Florental ones. The Inspired Buys that say Florental on them, you'll be able to see it on their website. And I have loved every single one. I think that's like probably my favorite ones. My top one's Florental Vanilla. This is probably my second now favorite one. It's for into almond. I'm gonna wear this on my little date night that I have with Darian tonight. So let's see if he likes it. He's liked every scent that I've tried so far. I'm gonna have their website and my code in the description. Let me know if you guys use my code and what scent that you guys use. I love seeing the kind of scents that you guys pick out. It helps me pick out my next scents. My code is Mackenzie10. And again, that will be in the description. All right, that is all. Back to the Jacksonville vlog. So it's just begun And there's something On the tip of your tongue Don't stay quiet Things that we keep You're Okay, we just spent the morning by the pool. It's like 3.30 now and I obviously just showered and changed and I am watching the game outside. The Clemson game is happening in Raleigh right now. So I'm watching that and I think we're heading to dinner later. I think we're getting Mexican and meeting some of Marissa's friends there. I had to take a break from watching the game because I was too stressed out. So I got ready for dinner. This is what I'm wearing. Just this cute little brown top from Princess Polly. I think it's from Princess Polly, could be for White Fox. Some jean shorts and these amazing shoes that this girl on Instagram made for me. Her name is Jada and I die for them. They're so cute. This is the first time I'm getting to wear them. So I'm excited. <laughs> Hamilton tickets for Monica's birthday. <laughs> if y'all do not know, which no one knows, Hamilton, we have literally watched like seven times all together. It's really like Olivia really got us like obsessed with it, but we know all the songs. And it's, apparently, it's happening in Jacksonville, so we're going in two weeks. <laughs> and Andrew gets to come. Well, we're also Dolly doing it at night. We're not doing the two oh, that's We're doing it at nighttime. You're doing the that's nighttime. So freaking Hamilton. cool. That's we have to like make this an event. Like I'm yeah, dressing you, up. I'm yeah, getting. Yeah, I'm, you, I'm getting. An, I'm getting an outfit it? for this. I'm shook. This is the best life. surprise I've ever gotten. I did not finish the vlog last night because Clemson lost. Good morning. 
I didn't finish the vlog last night because Clemson lost. And then I went to dinner with all of Marissa's friends. I just didn't want to be rude, like vlogging and all of that. But we had a great dinner. Now I'm making a coffee. Darian was supposed to fly in this morning at 9 o'clock. His flight got delayed. Marissa, Marissa's hearing this as y'all are hearing it. His flight got delayed. So I Dalton's... Like upstairs. No, Dalton is going to pick him up now. So they're just going to go straight to the game because he's not going to like be able to pick Darian up until like 10. And we're supposed to leave at 10, 15. He texted me and he was like, it has been a very unfortunate past 24 hours brownie face and I was like yeah you're right so they're not going to the playoffs um I mean of course it's not 100% but yeah, it's maybe a, there's a chance. yeah if like the top 10 teams all also, also somehow lose three games there's a chance but it's slim it's very unfortunate very sad we'll get his thoughts on it later if he's if he feels like talking about it but we do have to get ready because it's like it's nine Happened so fast. It's already nine o'clock, so we're gonna leave at probably like ten fifteen. We need to eat breakfast and experience the morning, so we do need to get ready. We have this Zara shirt that Marissa's letting me borrow. I think these are Princess Polly. Then these Princess Polly jeans that are like double sided. I don't really know what you call them. Like each side is a different color. Steve Madden shoes. This is like what the back of the jeans look like. And that's it. And I'll show you everyone else's. Outfit number one. I guess number two since I showed you mine. True. You're gonna be really hot. No, I'm so cold nature. I almost wear jeans. That's from your partner. Oh, those are Steve Madden boots? I thought they looked familiar. Love them. Love it. Show us the fit, Andrew. Oh yeah. We have a 16 jersey. We have the black jeans. We have the, are those fans? Yep. We have the dirty, classic vans. Dirty vans. Perfect. Oh, we have the matching. Oh, we love to see it. Biker shorts. Look at these cute little shoes. Can kiss this. And then last outfit. This cute so little get, teal top. Um, yeah. First Jaguars game. Look who's arrived. Can you flip that fast? We are on the road. It is Monday morning now. We left about an hour and a half ago. We stopped for Starbucks, of course. Now we're at a gas station. Here's Andrew and Olivia. 
at the gas station. <laughs> so last night, I think the last thing I showed was Andrew getting his cake and his presents. We were just celebrating his birthday, mostly last night. We had some Italian for dinner and went to the hot tub. We play this game called Murder in the Dark, and it sounds like creepy, but I can't explain it. Just Google it. It's, it's literally so much fun, and we play it pretty much every time we're together now. That was really fun. We played that for like two hours. I'm really sad that we have to leave. I'm always sad when we leave. Darian flew out this morning at like 4.30 because uh, he had to be home for practice. Other than Clemson losing, it was a great weekend the jaguars almost won but ended up losing which is really unfortunate other than those two things it was a perfect weekend thank you guys so much for watching this jacksonville vlog we're actually going to be back in two weeks to go see hamilton and celebrate monica's birthday so be on the lookout for that vlog turn on my post notifications if you guys never want to miss a video subscribe if you haven't we're so close to 20,000, and i will see you guys very soon with another video